Hello everybody, this is Bradford Harris, your internet specialist. This is a quick training on how to access your Gmail and your Google Drive. What you're going to do is you're going to open up a tab in Google Chrome. I recommend always using Chrome, not Safari or Explorer or any other browser because Chrome is going to be what we use uh, during the school year. You're going to type in google.com and then on the right hand side you're going to click sign in. Now again, these are for our newer teachers, uh, older teachers, you should already know how to do this. You're going to log in with your account. So it's going to be your username at aldeanisd.org. Click Next. Then you're going to put in your password, whatever password you decide to use. Sign in. Now once you're already in, you can access your mail in one or two ways. If you look at these nine squares right here, you can click on the nine squares, and you can click on mail, or you can click on the mail link right here. I'm going to go to the nine squares because that's going to be your um, kind of lifeline for the whole school year. So I'm going to click on the nine squares, then I'm going to click on mail. And this is how you would access your Gmail account for the district. Now, to access your drive, you can do it in one or two ways. I'm going to open up another tab. Once you're completely already signed in to um, uh, Google, you can type in drive.google.com. Press enter. And because I'm already signed in uh, from previous, it already pops in there. Okay. And you can also go into your email tab that you already have open, go to the nine squares, and click on the triangle that says Drive. And it will also open up. And that's how you access your Google Drive. Now, two important things that you need to look at when you're in here. Obviously, you're not going to have all these folders if you are a new teacher. You're going to need to go to Shared With Me. And in that Shared With Me, there's going to be a folder that's going to be called this. It is going to be called Staff Development 1617. Anything that we do for the year is going to be put into that folder, Staff Development 1617. Obviously, it's in my drive because I've created it, but I've shared it with you guys, so you're going to need to look at it in the share with me. All of your stuff will be there. So, guys, if you have any questions, let me know.